was the son of a pizza man, the only boy who could ever Hey guys, welcome to Son of the Pizza Man. My name is Enzo, and today we're doing a sausage and sage pizza. So I found this recipe uh, over on pizzatoday.com. They're essentially a resource for pizzeria owners, but sometimes they publish uh, recipes for pizza that look really good. So I saw this, I was like, it's an awesome com uh, flavor combination. It's, it's very, it reminds me of Thanksgiving, like <laughs> stuffing, like sausage and stuffing and sage. So I thought that would be awesome on a pizza. So I thought, why not? So the first thing I'm gonna do is put a base of tomato sauce. And then I'm gonna put a layer of mozzarella cheese. And then the best part, uh, the sausage mixture. So it's basically ground up sausage, some sage, some garlic, um, and some spices. So it should be really tasty. Just gonna sprinkle this very liberally. Also a quick tip, you always wanna cook your ingredients for the most part, before you put them on a pizza, especially meat. You always want to cook meat before you put it on a pizza because um, there's no telling that it'll actually cook during the process because typically a pizza will take between 10 and 12 minutes and that sometimes it's not enough to cook your meat through. So always cook your meat before you put it on the pizza. The next thing we're gonna add are picante peppers. I was not able to find picante peppers. They're basically sweet cherry peppers. So that's what these are. Picante peppers are specifically the red cherry peppers, but these will do. It just adds a, a nice sweetness to the pizza. And sausage and peppers is a great combo. And then we're going to top it off with some more mozzarella. So while we wait for the pizza, I just want to take a quick second and say thank you uh, if you are a returning subscriber. Uh, you mean a lot to me. If you are a new subscriber, welcome. Welcome to my channel. And uh, please consider subscribing. All you need to do is hit that button and then you'll be subscribed. And also if you want to hit that notification bell right next to it, you'll be notified when I upload new videos. Thank you. So today's pizza is baking on a baking steel as opposed to a pizza stone. Uh, so the difference is that it's supposed to heat up, I think, quicker and heat more evenly, but we'll see I'm testing it out. So we'll see how this sucker does and uh, we'll go from there. So the pizza baked at 550 for about nine minutes and it looks so delicious. Look at that. Look how good that looks. I'm very impressed with myself. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, okay, so let's just um, get into it and see how it tastes. This looks so good. Uh, I'm very, happy with the crust. Uh, the bottom is nice and crispy, which is awesome. So let's just taste it. So it's a solid sausage pizza, essentially. So the sausage and the peppers complement each other because you have the, the richness of the sausage against the sweetness, which kind of cuts into the sausage. And then the mozzarella and the sauce and the, um, yeah, it just, it just tastes lovely. Uh, it's a great combo. I would definitely recommend trying this. I'll put the instructions and the recipe in the description below. And I hope you try it. If you do try it, please tag me on social media. You can find me on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. And um, please remember to subscribe as well. Just hit that button and you'll be good to go. So if you like this video, give it a big fat thumbs up. And until next time, Ciao for now. The only one who could ever need me was the son of a pizza man. The only boy who could ever